Welcome to Booze in the Rocks, where we make cocktails for everyone. My name is David Edwards, and it's great to have you here today. We're going to make a Neon Nightmare, and it is similar to a liquid marijuana cocktail, which I will put a link at the very end of the video, so you can take a look and see the differences and how similar they are. Now, it's a build-in-the-glass cocktail that really needs very few measurements, which is perfect because the simpler the better. And what we'll do is we'll start this with a little bit of Malibu coconut here for a total of one ounce or 30 milliliters. Now this is a low ABV drink based on all of the alcohols that I'm using here. But our next ingredient is a sour apple liqueur. You could use a sour apple pucket. I'm using Sour Puss. It's a 15% ABV cocktail. Liqueur. But we're gonna use the same amount of one ounce or 30 mils. Now, one of the good things about this cocktail, it is really simple and easy to put together. And I know that I said this is a build in a glass cocktail, but you know what? I'm doing my steps wrong because you could do this directly over ice if you wanted. However, I've decided to do it a different way today, mostly because I forgot it was built in a glass. So add yourself some melon liqueur. I'm using Midori and we can use one ounce or 30 mils. Your fourth ingredient is a little bit of blue curacao. And what that's going to do is change it from a neon green to a neon something. However, blue curacao is awesome because it gives you the flavor of oranges. Now we're going to use the same amount again of one ounce or 30 mils. Because I messed up on the way I made this cocktail, normally you would make this uh, on ice directly, simple, easy. I'm going to jam the ice in now and you'll see exactly why in a moment. So just pop this full of ice. And now what we're going to do is we're just going to fill this up with a little bit of pineapple juice, but remember we want to keep it to about there. All right, so as you can tell, it's not incorporated. Now you could stir it, but really truth be told, any reason to sort of shake a little bit of smile. And oops not do it like that. <laughs> I'm having a day of it. So just pour this back in and it'll give you a gorgeous looking cocktail that is absolutely full to the brim. And this is a neon nightmare. Now it looks not quite neon, but it does look fantastic enough to drink. Mm, really good. You get the pineapple juice. You get a little bit of that melon, some hints of the uh, coconut and the orange. If you like this style of cocktail, take a look right here. 